as the choir comes with our last two selections as they're making the chain, I'd just like to ask for a special prayer for a situation that's going on in my life. I just learned Friday that my brother, who was 26 years old, he was diagnosed Friday with leukemia. And he is a believer in God, and I know that the Lord can heal his body. And I'm not really worried about him, but you know, I'm human, and that's my brother. And I want you all to pray for me, because it's been hard for me to, to even be here today. But I know that the Lord has given me the strength that I need, and he will continue to give me the strength that I need. I know the Lord will heal my brother's body, and I just ask that you pray for me, pray for my family, pray for the choir. You are looking at one of the hardest working group of students at Kentucky State University. And I want the choir to know that I love them and I appreciate all of their hard work. This may be my last extravaganza with the choir as director. Uh, and I think we've had, a, we've had a wonderful semester, we've had a wonderful year, and I just want the choir to know that I love you and you're always in my heart, no matter where I am. And I want you all to just keep on keeping on and lifting up Jesus, amen. Does anybody want to go to heaven? Is anybody striving to go to heaven? Well, I wanted to let you know that Sister Karen Clark Sheard called me and told me she couldn't make it this evening. But we've got, we've got a show enough singer, amen, and Sister Nia McKnight. Don't look for her to sing. To, to be like Karen Clark, because she's not Karen Clark, she is. Amen. But I tell you what, it's not about, it's not necessarily about the way you sing, but God looks at the sincerity of your heart. Amen. So pray for the as she comes. Amen.